it's Liz. Today I am finally gonna be doing a dorm tour. So I am in my last week of school here at Virginia Tech. My roommate Clarice and I cleaned up our room one last time so I could go ahead and film it and show you guys where I've been living for the past like nine months. So like I said, I go to Virginia Tech and I have lived in the dorm called Slusher. I live in Slusher Tower. But yeah, I thought you guys would find this video entertaining and fun to watch and also if anyone is going to be living at Virginia Tech and maybe in Slusher in the future, you get a little sneak peek of what Slusher looks like. Now, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the tour. Okay, so when you first walk into the room, this is what you see. So my roommate Clarice has her bed um, just on a little bit of a loft down here and then mine is lofted up there. So this is kind of her side of the room and then I kind of have the second half over there. So, this first wall here has a combination of both mine and Clarice, pictures that are mine and Clarice's. Um, this is, we put up a lot of pictures in our room. There are two cork boards and then a little mirror thing that you can write messages on with the whiteboard in the middle. And then I'll just show you Clarice's side real quick because it's really cute. <laughs> so she's in uh, the sorority Kayo. So she has lots of Kayo stuff. And then underneath there we have the printer that we use and then Clarice just stores stuff underneath there. And then Clarice's desk. Um, the cool thing about um, Slusher, I guess if there is anything cool about Slusher, is that you get an entire wall of cabinets and storage. So that's really nice. So right here is Clarice's closet cabinets and then her little like cubby area. So this is my closet right here and I'll go ahead and open this up. It's a little bit of a tight squeeze with my bed right here, but it works. So I just keep like sweatpants, sweatshirts up there and then workout clothes. Then along here I have pants, skirts, tops and sweaters. I keep a lot of my shoes in this bin right here and then the rest I keep um, down here on the floor, which you can't really see because it's dark. And then I have all my hanging clothes right here. Then I have three drawers. The first one is just underwear. The second one, if I, you guys can see, the second one is socks and sports bras. And then the third one is just bras. So actually some pretty good storage in here. And then I just hang up my jackets on the two hooks that I put in here. Now moving on to my cubby. So there are two shelves that you can choose how, you know, the height that you want them to be. And then you just have like a surface and then a drawer. So up here is where I keep most of my dishes. And then I also have my um, laundry stuff. So like detergent, fabric softener. Down here is my shower caddy that I just take with me whenever I go to the shower along with all of my other products. So I have lots of hair stuff, um, my like toothpaste, face wash, um, like hair masks and moisturizers, um, my hairbrush, contacts, glasses. And then here on top of the microwave, I have this cute little elephant from Forever 21 that has rings on it and then just a bowl that has jewelry and stuff in there. And then I keep all of my necklaces hung up um, on the side right here. And Clarice did the same thing over on hers. So that's kind of cool that we did the same thing there. Um, also here we have a hot water kettle and my friend Natalie's like Starbucks cup. And this is also where we dry dishes. So there are just some towels here for doing dishes. Your room comes with a recycling bin. We haven't used it for recycling. I just keep my laundry basket in it because they're really strict about making sure that your recycling bin stays clean. Um, the first bin I have filled with food and then the second one as you can see it's like fuzzy socks sweaters it's um clothes that I'm not wearing right now and that I'm just starting to go ahead and pack up this drawer is a little crazy it consists mainly of like curling irons flat irons and then products that I have used up that I'm saving up to do a empties video on kind of random stuff in here then right here we have our little sink area it's so nice that it comes with the sink it's been very useful um you might notice that this is turned really weirdly and that's because our sink like flooded and broke. Definitely not my fault at all. <laughs> um, so Clarice and I kind of split up the sink. It looks kind of gross but that's just like how it's stained. Um, so like I have my mouthwash, uh, sea salt scrub, 
There's like dish soap, a sponge, and then Clarice has all of her stuff over here, plus our toothbrushes. And then there are towel racks, hey, on each side. Then just on the ground there, we have a rug and our trash can. Then we have a full length mirror right here, which is actually really good placement um, since Clarice can use it if she's like standing back like at her area or I can use it if I'm here so it works out really well then here we have the fridge the fridge is from Costco it's a high sense fridge uh, but it's nice because it has a separate freezer from the actual fridge so our frozen stuff actually stays frozen um, on top we just have like cleaning supplies air freshener water filter paper towels then here we have not one but two footstools because we got this smaller one at first Except that wasn't tall enough to be able to reach the cabinets up there, so then I had to get that bigger one. I have my yoga mat. I also have my um, little mannequin body form that I use for sewing. Um, this is our window. We actually have a really pretty view. As you can see, the trees have finally bloomed and it's so nice outside. Normally this is open with at least one fan on there and turned on, but it was really loud, so I had to turn it off for the video. But yeah, we have two box fans. Um, this is just a clothes drying rack. This area right here is my, like, dresser. And then on top, we have just always kept all of, like, our breakfast food on here. Sometimes it's completely filled with breakfast foods. Now, since it's the end of the year, we don't have as much, but we still have a decent amount of food. Um, Clarice got campus cookies from her mom, so those have been really good. I have, like, a bag of cereal. Just other cereals, granola silverware like measuring cups i have an iron some like cans of food and this has been really nice having like a little candle warmer um to like melt candles so the room smells good i have this which is like a board for cutting fabric for sewing and then we also have a whiteboard back here which is clarice's which is so nice for studying for both of us then on this wall, more pictures. We love decorating our room with pictures. So this is just more of my pictures. So this is kind of just like an overview of what my little area underneath my bed looks like. Um, it worked out pretty well. This is how we've had our room set up the entire year and we're pretty happy with it. Uh, the carpet is from Walmart. Um, I just have my towel hanging up here on these little like bungee hooks that my mom found at Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, for my desk, I have more pictures hanging up behind my TV. Um, I got this TV off of Craigslist. <laughs> it was really cheap and I love it because I can watch Netflix on it. Um, also on here, I have my makeup brushes and this cute little owl thing from like TJ Maxx. And then um, this organizer with like books and pens and calculators and everything from TJ Maxx as well. This like LED lamp that was from like Target or something. A mini fan, Clarice and I both have these mini fans. They are so useful, especially because you can clip them up on your bed and that's really good for when it's really hot outside. Um, this floor lamp is from Walmart, I believe. Um, and then I have this little thing attached to my bed, like a bed caddy because I wear glasses and I'm like always on my laptop last thing before I go to bed. Um, this is from, I want to say Bed Bath & Beyond, my mom got it for me. So as you can see, our desks are actually really big and they have a ton of room on them, which is really nice. So I'll just show you guys what's in the drawers real quick. So in this first drawer here, I just have a PlayStation. There, I really have not used it that much. I used it a lot more at the beginning of the semester, but it's still nice to have. I got a second controller, so I guess I could like play with someone sometime, but I really haven't used it a lot recently. The second drawer is just all of my like art stuff since I had a portfolio like fashion class last semester. It's kind of a mess in here. And then this last drawer is just like tissues. My camera bag is back there and then just a bunch of like meds and like vitamins. In this drawer, I don't really keep that much. I have like a mouse pad, a mouse, like headphones, chargers, sticky notes, and then like a bunch of random stuff here that just doesn't have a home. So my roommate just got here. This is Clarice. You guys probably remember her from the other video we did. I'll link it below. Um, so on this little like bar here on my bed, I hung up like all these little like Pinteresty, Tumblr-y like motivational quotes, which is funny because one of my friends literally like hates motivational quotes. I love them. Um, up here I have this like whiteboard calendar that I really did not use that much, but it was a nice thought. 
I have these two sets of like those basic plastic drawers that you can get from like Walmart or Target or anywhere. In this first drawer, I have like kitchen stuff. Uh, this one, I have like razors and I keep all my nail polish in here. And then in this bottom one, I have like laundry detergent, makeup bags, and like travel size bottles. This first one here, I have like stamps and different like decorations we'd put up in our room. Um, these next two drawers are just all of my makeup. This one is all of my like electronic stuff. And this bottom one is like my hair dryer and then like sunscreen and face lotion that I don't use and soap and a bunch of kind of random stuff. I keep all of my art supplies in this. Um, kind of like just it's basic stuff like markers and pens and pencils and paint and then in this milk cart is that what they're called milk crates but I have like all of my books and binders for class in here um, they kind of all have to get jammed in there but it works pretty well so in this dresser the first drawer has my pajamas and then all of my t-shirts and then the second one has like shorts, some towels, and then just like more summery clothes, like a bathing, like bathing suits and rompers. And so this is my bed. It's lofted up as high as it can go, and it has that little bar over there so I don't roll off on that side. Um, my bedding's pretty boring, honestly. I have this like gray duvet cover from Target. All of these pillows are from Target, I think. Maybe some of them are from TJ Maxx. But yeah, I keep a lot of pillows up there and most of them end up on the ground when I'm sleeping. So like I said, this room has a ton of storage. So in these cabinets up here, I keep things like my sewing machine, um, like a quilt for sitting outside, extra cleaning supplies, and just other stuff that I really don't need all the time. All right, so I really hope you guys enjoyed that quick little video just showing you guys around my room. Um, I don't think I'm going to miss it that much uh, because I'm living with Clarice again next year and we're going to be living off campus in a townhouse so I'm very excited to upgrade and to have my own bathroom and my own bedroom and have a kitchen and it's just going to be so great so I'm really looking forward to that. Yeah, thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye!